hey guys what's going on so in this video i'm going to be sharing with you guys the best bank cards right now that you can use to make any online purchases that you are trying to make right now and it's going to go successfully all right now one key point about this video is that the cards i'm going to be sharing with you guys in this video works across all platform all right whether you're trying to use it on amazon to buy product or whether you're trying to use it on apple pay or whether you're trying to use it to buy any product or services online these bank cards are guaranteed to work for you so if you have been struggling to have a bank card that you can use to make any online purchases this video will definitely show you the bank cards that you can definitely use today and it's gonna work 100% for you and regardless of the currency you have in your account you can definitely use this bank card to go out there and start making purchases online and start getting the goods and services that you want to get from the online marketplace so as you have already known you can no longer be able to use most of your Nigerian bank cards right now to make any purchases online or to pay for any international transaction, okay? Even the $20 limit that they placed on the card most of the times no longer works for most of these bank cards, alright? And this has become a major problem for most of us that relies on buying products online or buying services online and using our card to perform transactions to be able to run our businesses successfully, okay? And this does not look as if it's gonna end very, very soon, alright? Right? so these limitations has been there and that we don't know when these limitations are going to be lifted and that's why today i've decided to share with you guys the major bankers that i have all right i have three bankers right now that i use to make online transactions without any limit in fact i cannot even exhaust the amount of money i can spend on most of these cards that i have right now and i'm going to be sharing it with you guys so that you can be able to know the different bankers you can go out there right now and get for you to be able to start making online transaction and it doesn't matter any currency that you have right now even if you have naira in your account i'm also going to show you the cards that you can be able to use to use that your Naira to pay for any international transaction you want to pay for and get it approved successfully to be able to buy the product or services that you are interested in getting. And like I said earlier, I'm going to be sharing with you guys the trade bank cards that you can use to make international transactions, but I'm going to be starting with the ones that is going to be a bit difficult for most of you guys that are watching this video to get because there are several processes and requirements involved to get them and also to go ahead and use those cards. But after that, I'm going to show you guys the bank cards that anyone that is currently watching this video could be able to get and use them to make international transactions without any problem all right so if you are a big spender online you can go ahead and get the trade cards if you are not just get one of those cards and go out there and run your businesses and get the product or services that you want to get from the international market without any hassles so the first two bank cards that might be a bit difficult for you to get and also to use them to make international transactions is this pioneer card and also the dollar debit card that you can get from your bank now the pioneer card can be very difficult for you to get because first of time you have to create a pioneer account and once you're done creating a pioneer account you need to receive some funds on your account like hundred dollar before you can go ahead to request this card okay now this can also be a problem when you also want to use the pioneer card to make online transaction because you need to have pioneer funds on your account for you to be able to use this card to make online transaction but if you are someone that works on platforms like fiverr or any other freelance platform you can easily withdraw your earnings to pioneer and use your pioneer card to buy the product or services that you want to buy all right so that's it for the pioneer card now for the dollar card which you can easily get from your bank you can easily use this card right now to make any online transaction you want to make but you need to have dollar in that your dollar account okay or your domiciliary account for you to be able to request for this card and for you to be able to use this card to make international transactions all right and the process of getting dollar to your dollar account so that you can be able to use this dollar card to make online transaction can be difficult for most people okay because it takes the process of going to look for people that sells dollar to buy dollar from them and putting it into your account for you to be able to use this card or if you are someone that works online and you are withdrawing your earnings on dollar and putting it into your dollar account these are the ways you can be able to use these cards okay so you need to have dollar in this account or you need to have pioneer funds in this account for you to be able to use these cards that you are seeing right here so you see why it is very very difficult for most people right now to get these two cards right now to use them to be able to make international transactions so if you're among the people that 
I couldn't get the Payoneer card or the Dollar card from your bank and be able to fund them so that you can be able to use them to make international transactions, you don't have to worry right now because right now, I'm going to now show you the bank card that you can easily use to make international payments without having to go through the tedious process of getting and using cards such as these ones that I'm holding right now, okay? So the bank card that you can get right now for you to be able to use them to make international transactions even while having Naira in your bank account is this Providus bank card, alright? Now, this Providus bank is a bank right here in Nigeria that is going to help you to be able to make international transactions while having Naira in your account. So, the card that I'm holding right here is their Platinum card which is going to allow you to be able to spend up to $3,000 monthly just by using this card, okay? Now, they also have what is known as their Classic card which is going to allow you to spend like $1,200, alright? Now, but the cash right here for using this bank is that this bank is going to charge you at the black market rate okay so if you, the black market is going for 740 that means that they are going to charge you 740 for one dollar when you're trying to buy the product online but you don't have to go ahead to change any dollar or you don't have to go ahead and convert your currency from naira to dollar and put in your account for you to be able to use it no once you have an account with the providers bank you could be able to go ahead and use their card to make online transactions okay so it depends on how you spend online okay so if you don't need to spend much more money you can go ahead and get the classic card which you can spend upwards of $1,200 per month using that card but with this platinum card that I have right here you could be able to spend upwards of $3,000 every month just by using that card but note that they are going to be charging you based on black market rates now before you argue whether this is fair or not fair because they are charging you the black market rate for you to make online transaction you also have to consider that right now it's very difficult for you to use your naira card to make any international transaction and if your business relies on making international transaction and paying for products and services you cannot be able to do it with most of these bank cards naira card all right but with the cards that the providers bank is going to be providing you it can help you to be able to do that even at black market rate because even if they don't do it you still have to go and buy dollar and put in your dollar account for you to be able to use that your dollar card to make payment all right so this is going to be a better solution for most of you that is watching this video but another important part that you also need to pay attention is that for you to open account with these guys right here currently they are going to ask you to deposit a sum of 100,000 naira all right so i think that's the least amount that they are getting right now okay don't quote me on that try and verify on your own okay but i think that's the least amount right now that they are quoting for you to be able to get an account with them and that your money that you're depositing right here is still your own once you deposit it and they provide it to your, with your card if you want you can go ahead and withdraw all your money to zero balance right there okay and if you have any more questions you can simply go on their website on providersbank.com so that you can be able to get any other informations that you are looking to get from them all right so you can get information about their savings account their current account about their cars and you are going to see a chat box that's going to pop up right here where you can be able to go ahead and click to shut them up live okay you can ask them any question you want to ask them or you can click on contact them to ask them any question you want to ask them concerning their branches where they are located and how you can be able to go about getting the account and also getting their cards so these are the three best bank cards that you can get today to start making online payment or transactions without any hassles all right so you can go ahead and get the three of them if you're a big spender online or you can simply get one of them to be able to make your online payment without any problem okay and remember if you have any questions concerning most especially providers bank you can go ahead and shut them up to contact them so that you can be able to get the right answers to your questions okay so if you have questions about their locations whether they are located in your city or in your state or anywhere do well to ask them they are going to be able to provide you a better answer okay or if you have any other question you want to ask me do well to drop it in the comment section and i'm going to respond to your questions okay and also if you know that this video was valuable to you do well to share this video to other people that you know that is going to find this video valuable so that they will be able to get equipped with this information and go out there and start getting the bank card they can use to make international transactions all right if you find this video valuable don't forget to subscribe to this channel like this video and click that bell notification icon so that once i drop new awesome video right here on youtube youtube will notify you you will come right here 
take advantage of the video I'm sharing right here and go out there and start building your successful online businesses. Thank you guys for watching this video and I hope to see you in my next video.